Fedora Linux is one of those operating systems that quietly sits at the heart of the modern. Open source world while constantly pushing boundaries and shaping the future of Linux itself. To understand Fedora, you have to think of it not just as a Linux distribution you install on your laptop or desktop, but as a living, evolving project that acts as a testing ground, a proving arena, and a vision of what Linux can become tomorrow. Fedora is community-driven, sponsored by Red Hat, and deeply rooted in the philosophy of free and open source software. From the very beginning, its mission has been clear, to advance free software and provide cutting edge technology in a stable, reliable, and elegant way. Fedora's origins trace back to the early 2000s, when Red Hat Linux was one of the most popular distributions available. At that time, Red Hat decided to split its efforts into two paths. One path became Red Hat Enterprise Linux, a commercially supported, long-term stability-focused operating system for businesses and enterprises. The other path became Fedora, a community-supported project designed to move fast, experiment boldly, and integrate the latest innovations in Linux. This separation allowed Fedora to act as an upstream source for Red Hat Enterprise Linux, meaning many technologies first appear in Fedora, get tested and refined by the community, and eventually make their way into enterprise environments once they are mature and proven. When you install Fedora, you are stepping into a system that values freedom, openness, and innovation. Fedora has a strict policy about software freedom, which means that by default, it includes only free and open source software. Proprietary drivers and codecs are not included out of the box, not because Fedora ignores user convenience, but because it takes software freedom seriously. The Fedora project believes users should have full control over their systems and should be able to inspect, modify, and share the software they use. That philosophy shapes everything from package selection to documentation and community governance. One of the most defining characteristics of Fedora Linux is how up-to-date it is. Fedora releases new versions approximately every six months. And each release includes some of the latest versions of the Linux kernel, desktop environments, programming languages, and system tools. This makes Fedora an excellent choice for developers, enthusiasts, and anyone who wants early access to new technologies. When a new kernel feature, file system improvement, or desktop innovation appears, chances are high that Fedora will be one of the first major distributions to ship it. Fedora Workstation is perhaps the most well-known addition of Fedora. It is designed primarily for desktop and laptop users, especially developers, engineers, and creators. Fedora Workstation focuses on providing a clean, modern, and distraction-free desktop experience. By default, it uses the GNOME desktop environment, which emphasizes simplicity, productivity, and a keyboard-driven workflow. Fedora's GNOME implementation is very close to upstream GNOME, meaning it does not heavily customize or modify the desktop. This results in a polished, consistent experience that reflects the GNOME project's original vision. The Fedora workstation experience is smooth and refined. The installer, known as Anaconda, has improved significantly over the years and provides a straightforward way to install the system, manage disks, and configure basic settings. Once installed, Fedora Workstation feels responsive and modern. Animations are fluid, the interface is clean, and the overall performance is impressive, even on modest hardware. Fedora often integrates Wayland by default, instead of the older X11 display server, which brings better security and smoother graphics, especially on modern systems. Under the hood, Fedora is a powerhouse. It uses the RPM package format along with the DNF package manager, which is known for its reliability and dependency resolution. Installing, updating, and removing software is generally fast and predictable. Fedora also embraces modern packaging technologies such as Flatpak, which allows applications to be distributed in a sandboxed, universal format. Flatpak integration in Fedora Workstation is excellent, making it easy to install applications from Flathub while keeping the core system clean and stable. Fedora is not just about desktops. The Fedora project offers multiple additions tailored to different use cases. Fedora Server is designed for servers and data centers, did. providing a stable yet modern platform for hosting services, applications, and infrastructure. Fedora Server emphasizes modularity, flexibility, and automation. It integrates well with container technologies and virtualization tools, 
making it suitable for both traditional servers and cloud environments. Fedora Koros is another important addition, especially in the world of containers and cloud-native computing. Fedora Koros is an automatically updating minimal operating system designed to run containerized workloads. It combines technologies from Fedora, Koros, and Red Hat Enterprise Linux to create a system that is secure, mutable, and optimized for large-scale deployments. Koros is widely used in Kubernetes environments and plays a crucial role in modern DevOps workflows. For users who prefer different desktop environments, Fedora spins provide alternative desktop experiences built on the same Fedora base. Whether you prefer KDE Plasma, XFCEL, XQT, Cinnamon, Mate, or other environments. Fedora spins allow you to choose the interface that best suits your workflow and hardware. Each spin is officially maintained and tested, ensuring quality and consistency across the ecosystem. Fedora Labs go even further by offering pre-configured systems tailored to specific purposes. There are labs for scientific computing, robotics, design, security, gaming, and more. These labs come with carefully selected software packages that make it easy to get started in a particular out field without spending hours setting everything up manually. Out. This makes Fedora appealing not only to general users, but also to professionals and students in specialized domains. Security is another area where Fedora excels. Fedora often adopts new security technologies early, such as C-Linux, which provides mandatory access control and significantly enhances system security. While SE Linux can be complex, Fedora configures it in a way that offers strong protection without getting in the user's way. Fedora also benefits from rapid security updates, thanks to its active community and close relationship with Red Hat's security teams. From a developer's perspective, Fedora is a dream platform. It ships with the latest versions of popular programming languages such as Python, GCC, Rust, Go, and Java. Development tools, debuggers, and libraries are readily available through the official repositories. Fedora's focus on upstream collaboration means that bugs are reported and fixed quickly, and developers often work directly with upstream projects rather than maintaining heavily patched versions of software. Another major strength of Fedora is its community. The Fedora project is governed by the Fedora Council and relies on contributions from thousands of volunteers around the world. These contributors are involved in everything from package maintenance and quality assurance to documentation, design, marketing, and community outreach. Fedora's community culture is welcoming, inclusive, and transparent. Decisions are discussed openly, and anyone can get involved regardless of their background or level of experience. Fedora's release lifecycle is another important aspect to understand. Each Fedora release is supported for approximately 13 months, which means you can skip one release, and still stay supported. This release cadence strikes a balance between staying current and maintaining stability. While Fedora is known for being cutting edge, it is also remarkably stable for day-to-day -day use, provided you keep your system updated and follow best practices. Performance is another area where Fedora shines. Thanks to its close relationship with the Linux kernel community, Fedora often includes performance improvements and optimizations early. Boot times are fast, System responsiveness is excellent, and resource usage is generally well-managed. Fedora also integrates Systemd, which provides fast booting, parallel service startup, and powerful system management capabilities. Customization is a key part of the Fedora experience. While the default setup is clean and minimal, Fedora allows you to customize nearly every aspect of the system. From changing the desktop environment and window manager, to tweaking system services and kernel parameters, Fedora gives users the freedom to shape their system according to their needs. This flexibility makes Fedora suitable for both beginners who want a system that just works and advanced users who enjoy fine-tuning their environment. Fedora's relationship with Red Hat is often misunderstood. While Red Hat sponsors Fedora and provides infrastructure and resources, Fedora remains a community-driven project. Red Hat engineers contribute heavily to Fedora, but they do so as members of the community. This relationship benefits Fedora users because it ensures a high level of professionalism, quality assurance, and long-term vision. While still preserving Fedora's independence and experimental spirit, in terms of hardware support, Fedora is generally excellent, especially for newer hardware. 
Because it ships recent kernels and drivers, Fedora often supports the latest CPUs, GPUs, and peripherals sooner than more conservative distributions. This makes it a popular choice for users with modern laptops or desktops. However, because Fedora prioritizes free software, users with certain proprietary hardware may need to take extra steps to install third-party drivers or firmware. Fedora is also an educational platform. Many users learn Linux by using Fedora because it exposes them to modern tools, best practices, and upstream projects. Fedora's documentation is extensive and well-maintained, covering everything from installation and troubleshooting to advanced system administration. The Fedora wiki forums, mailing lists, and chat channels provide a wealth of knowledge and support. When it comes to multimedia and everyday use, Fedora can be just as capable as any other desktop operating system. With a few additional repositories enabled, users can easily install multimedia codecs, video players, music applications, and creative tools. Fedora supports popular applications like Firefox, LibreOffice, GIMP, Blender, and many others, making it suitable for work, study, and entertainment. One of the most exciting aspects of Fedora is how it shapes the future of Linux. Technologies like Systemd, Wayland, Pipewire, and BTRFs gained widespread adoption, thanks in part to Fedora's willingness to integrate and refine them early. By using Fedora, you are not just consuming an operating system. You are participating in a broader ecosystem that drives innovation across the entire Linux landscape. Fedora's design philosophy emphasizes simplicity and clarity. Rather than overwhelming users with excessive customization options out of the box, Fedora provides sensible defaults that work well for most people. At the same time, it does not restrict users who want to go deeper. This balance between simplicity and power is one of Fedora's greatest strengths. Over the years, Fedora has earned a reputation for quality and reliability. While it is sometimes described as a testing ground, this does not mean it is unstable or unsafe. On the contrary, Fedora has rigorous testing processes, including automated tests and community-driven quality assurance. Each release goes through multiple beta and release candidate stages before being declared stable. For content creators, Fedora offers a solid platform for video editing, audio production, graphic design, and 3D modeling. Applications like KDN Live, Ardor, Krita, and Blender run well on Fedora. Die! And the system's performance and stability make it suitable for demanding creative workloads. With proper configuration, Fedora can even be used for gaming, thanks to support for Steam, Proton, and modern graphics drivers. Fedora's commitment to accessibility is another important aspect. The GNOME desktop includes a range of accessibility features, such as screen readers, magnifiers, and high contrast themes. Fedora works closely with upstream projects to ensure that these features are continuously improved, making Linux more accessible to users with different needs. In the world of cloud computing, Fedora plays a crucial role. Fedora cloud images are available for major cloud providers, allowing users to deploy Fedora-based virtual machines quickly and easily. These images are lightweight, secure, and optimized for cloud environments, making them suitable for development, testing, and production workloads. Ultimately, Fedora Linux represents a philosophy as much as it represents a product. It is about openness, collaboration, and progress. It is about trusting users with powerful tools while providing a polished and coherent experience. It is about building the future of Linux in the open, with input from a global community. If you choose Fedora, you are choosing to be close to the cutting edge without sacrificing stability. You are choosing a system that respects your freedom, values quality, and embraces innovation. Whether you are a developer, a student, a system administrator, or simply someone curious about Linux, Fedora offers a rich, rewarding experience that continues to evolve with each release. Fedora is not just an operating system you install once and forget. It is a journey into the heart of modern open source computing, constantly moving forward, constantly improving, and constantly inviting you to be part of something bigger.